So it's over the start of the Moors Millions qualifiers, and these will be a staple throughout the season. Two of them each week. A slightly shorter one, a slightly longer one. They're maidens this week. They usually handicap three mile five foot on the first one. The short one of the two blindsided Padraig Hogan, Rock City, David Derek Hinton, Swift Dancer, Obi Wan, Target, Greg Beckwith, the uncle Joshua Sutherland, Alfred Pan, Darren Thompson, Band of Outsiders, Leon Van Rinsburg, Algeria, Alex Cherry, Lakeside, Meath. Stu Gray, Larissa Styles, Jim Murray, Paper Sweep, Graham Clutterbuck, Sarah Manamu for Matt Cooper, Scarp Tree, David Robertson, Sweet Women, David Hooley, and Trim and Run Request was the bottom one there away and racing. And down towards the first, that's Thomas Rogers, the Trim and Run Request, the bottom one as they come to the first of 23 fences. I think they're going to finish in the first four, I think they qualify for the final which is in the last week of the season and they get over the first and they're all safely over it with the uncle the first one to show opportunity for these horses to get qualified really early so we look forward to the end of the season as they get to the second which they're all safely over swift, swift dancer he's now the leader for ob1 into a two length lead from the uncle and Triven run requests as they get to this ditch. Just there again, all safely over. The lakeside and the Meath. Just the back marker, but no more than eight lengths or so off the leader. At this point, they've got a long, long way to go still. One over three miles still to travel. And they're coming down towards the fourth of the 23 fences that they want to negotiate. And it's Swift Dancer in the lead. The uncle second. Trivan Run Request, the first of the greys after that one. It's Jim Murray's out. Um, Jim Murray's Larissa Stars didn't jump that one all that well. And lost its place a little bit. Paper Sweep is the new back market. Just a case of getting it all settled and jumping okay for the first circuit or so in these races. And keeping in touch. And Swift Dancer is over that one in the lead. The uncle in second, band of outsiders on the wide outside is third, and then Trivan Run Request between them is fourth. As they get over the sixth, then Larissa Styles and blindsided Sarah Manamu has made a little bit of a forward move as well. That one was out the back of the on, but he's now up towards the leaders as they get over at number seven. The swift dancer in the lead. They can't pass the stun then. That's the big screen. Totalise eight aboard, they're going to go around another twice yet. And it's Swift Dancer who is in the lead. From the Rissa Styles has now moved through into second. And Triven Run Request and the Uncle. With a bit of a gap then to Band of Outsiders, Blindsided and Saraman and Moot. We have the Rock City and Scarp Tree. Target's over on the inside as well. Sweet Moon is nicely placed. And then Lakeside Meath getting a bit closer as they take the next. Back three at this point are Alfred Pan, Algeria, and finally Paper Sweep. Swift Dancer. Born along in the lead, been comfortable in front all the way so far. Jumping well. For Obi Wan. The Rissa Style second and the Uncle third. And Band of Outsiders is fourth as they get into the next. Safely over that one as well. The jump has been pretty good so far. Not too many mistakes. No major ones at all, really. And Swift Dancer is now four clear. Come into this next one. Jump on a little bit slow, the leader. And there was a mistake there this time by Triven Run Request. I've seen that one shuffled out of Patrick a little bit, but there's plenty of time to make up for that. We're only just inside the final two miles as we take this ditch safely over it again once again the leader was a little bit ponderous over it and that's allowed band of outsiders and Larissa starts to get a little bit closer the uncle on the inside is in fourth blindsided is now the closest that one's been to the lead also rock city's getting closer sarah man and move on the inside of sweet women and then lakeside meets the target and alfred pan they take the 12th again all safely over the 12th Rear a little bit untidy at the back, but nothing too dramatic. As the field of 15 continue to make their way around the course and down towards the next of the fences. This is 13 of 23. And there's a fall of it. Something gone. Rock City's gone. Rock City's down. 
So the first one to depart the race is Rock City. And they get to the 14th. And they'll also be over the 14th with Rock City out of, I think that's Derek Hinton's new colours as they come down to the 15th. This will be the last on the next circuit as they get over that one nicely. With the exception of Lakeside Meath, who's gone. So Lakeside Meath has unshipped the, unshipped the rider there. And he's now out of the race as well. So bad luck to Stu and Derek. And it's Swift Dancer who passes the winning post in the lead. Then Circuit to go. And it's Swift Dancer in the lead. From the Uncle in second and Blindsided in third. Then Alfred Pound has gone into fourth. And Scarp Tree and Larissa Styles. And then Trill Run Request and Target and Band of Outsiders. And then Sweet Women. And then a gap to the back three of Saraman and Mu Algeria. And finally, Paper Sweep as they get to the 16th. And we've got a new leader. The Uncle's gone on. The Uncle's gone on. There's a fall there. Band of Outsiders has gone. So Leon Van Rensburg is out now as well. So not that good a start to the season for Leon so far, really. It's the Uncle who's in the lead from Swift Dancer, who's now back in second. Blindsided is third. Alfred Pound is fourth. Larissa starts on the inside. And then Triven Run Request, who's getting closer again. Scarp Tree target. And Sweet Women are still there with. Plenty of chances as they get down to the 17th. It's this time they're all over. Sarah Manamu now just the back marker. But it's the uncle who leads by about a length. To Swift Dancer, who was in the lead for a long time in second and he's not dropping away. Alfred Pound on the outside is third. Then the Larissa, Larissa Stars and blindsided Sweet Women is making a good looking move around the outside as they come into this ditch and they get over that one nicely and Sweet Women jump through into second has now come through for a share of the lead. David Hooney looking for a quick fire double and Sweet Women takes it up with four and a half furlongs to go and just about four more fences to take and it's Sweet Women who's gone on from the uncle in second. Alfred Pound is now third. Larissa Stars is four. Blindsided is five as Swift Dancer finally does start to drop away a little bit but it's Sweet Women Women over the 20th in the lead. Little bit of a ponderous leap though. The uncle's in second. Triven Run Request has gone at the back. It's Alfred Pound in the third. Larissa starts running on in fourth. It's Sweet Women those four clear. Coming down to the third last fence then now. And it's Sweet Women clear in the lead. Being chased by Alfred Pound and the uncle and Larissa starts and blindsided. And another slow jump by the leader has allowed the pack to close. It's Sweet Women still in front though. Alfred Pound is getting closer. Larissa starts looks to be going best of all in third as they come down to the second. And last and again the leader wasn't quick over it but he's still in the lead sweet woman leading by two Alfred Pound is in second Larissa Stars is in third they're coming down to the final fence and over they're going this time the leader did jump it well and got away from it well and that's put the race to bed it's sweet woman who's now going to race towards the line and take the second race of the day the first leg of the Moors Millions and a quick fire double for David Hooley sweet woman takes it Alfred Pound is second target round to be third then Larissa Stars and blindsided the Umper and Scarp Tree Algeria was last David Hooley gets off to a perfect start for day two. It looked like the uh, jumping was going to let that one down towards the end. It wouldn't make a mistake, it was just jumping slowly, but carried on well and won nicely. Uh, sweet Women takes it for David Hooley. Second was Alfred Pound for Darren Thompson. Target for Greg Beckwith was third. Larissa Stars for Jim Murray was fourth. And Blindsided for Padraig Hogan was fifth.